Hey, what's up guys? It's Pierre HD from Czech Association and today I'm going to review another smartphone that is the Motorola Moto E. Let's see. It looks front facing speakers and if you talk about its buttons, yeah, great finish and metal buttons. So, as I have taken it for a uh, testing purpose, so I have not installed much apps or uh, nothing like that to make it a fancy and a good looking phone so if you see inside the smartphone here comes the google now menu as the lollipop update has not now came so i have installed the uh, google now launcher so here comes the first page where i have not installed any apps and all the apps are pre-installed on the second page i have installed the true caller the whatsapp and the zender it zender is a file sharing app so, as you have seen that I have not installed much apps and just taken it for a testing purpose. So, if you want a budgeted smartphone in the range of 6,000 to 7,000, I recommend you to take Moto E as it has the Motorola advantage and the pure Android with upgradable features. So, it has a front facing speakers which are good for listening the music and for video purposes, for editing and many more. And the other thing is the camera. It has a 5 megapixel camera, unfortunately without a flash. So, but it has the advantage of the Motorola, so it clicks great pictures. Let's take a look at its camera. Here is the Moto E's camera. It takes fast pictures. Sorry. Here is its camera. And now, the main feature which I like the most about the Moto E is its battery size. Amazing. It has a 1980mAh non-removable battery which is great and I tell you if you take it for a business purpose or list, uh, play games and listen music, watch videos and uh, get out by home with a 100% battery. I think you might come with a 15-20% to 20 battery which is great and the standby time amazing if you sleep about 100 percent battery you might wake up with a 95 percent plus battery which is great so now i told you everything about it and the last is the dimple at as uh, printed with the stylish m i liked it very much so talking about its screen it has a gorilla glass 3.0 which has a smooth touch and many more features so if you talk about my desktop I have just uh, installed the Google folder there are some Google apps and the Google Play Store it is a pretty simple phone so as I have not taken it for the gaming purpose so guys this was my review of a budgeted Motorola smartphone that is the Moto E hope you like it so now watch my next video till then goodbye